the city address today in Chico. But we need to keep in mind that this isn't the small town that it necessarily used to be. It is a very big growing city. We tell you what issues are most pressing to local leaders. Community leaders gathered at the Doubletree Hotel in Chico today to talk about the latest issues affecting the city. Action News Now reporter Lauren Cooper was at today's meeting. So Lauren, what are some of the key takeaways? Yeah, Alan, there was a lot that was talked about today from commercial flights to homelessness to road repairs. It was all brought up during the State of the City address. I caught up with Chico's mayor, Andrew Coolidge, who tells me the city's population is getting bigger and bigger each year. And with that, says Coolidge, a growing number of big city problems that require new solutions. Really, you know, Chico's in a very good position in terms of the North State. We're a growing city. We certainly have a lot of things coming forward with us. You know, we're really starting to experience some of the issues that come with cities that the size we are. If you go back to 1970, Chico was just under 20,000 people. 2000, this town was under 60,000 people. Now, we're topping out at about 107,000 people. Coolidge says he's feeling positive about how the city has dealt with the homeless crisis and is looking forward to plans for direct flights from Chico to L.A. During the address, it was mentioned that Butte County's unemployment rate has risen from 5.7% in 2023 to 6.8% as of February of this year. As of now, Butte County's unemployment rates rank 33 out of the 58 counties in California. But the county's gross domestic product, uh, which measures the market value of goods and services in the area, has risen over $36 million from 2021, bringing the total to about $9.1 billion. That's Alan. a big number, Lauren. Yes, thank it you. is. Well, thank you.